Hi and welcome to the session. Let's discuss the following question. It says convert the complex number iota in the polar form. So let us first understand the basic approach to solve it. Any complex number z is in the form x plus iota y where x is the real part and y is the imaginary part. And the polar form of Z is given by R into cos theta plus iota sin theta, where R is equal to root of x square plus y square and theta is the argument of Z. So, to convert a complex number in the polar form, we need to obtain r and theta. So, this is the key idea. Let's now move on to the solution. And let the complex number iota be denoted by z. So, z is equal to i, which in the form x plus iota y can be written as 0 plus iota into 1. On comparing it with x plus iota y, we can see that x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1. Now, to convert iota in the polar form, we need to obtain r and theta. So, let us first obtain r which is equal to root of 0 square plus 1 square and it is equal to 1. Now, z in the polar form can be written as r that is 1 into cos theta plus iota sin theta. Also, z is equal to 0 plus iota into 1. Let's call this equation as 1 and this as 2. Now, since the LHS of both the equations is same, therefore RHS are also same. So, this implies 1 into cos theta plus iota sin theta is equal to 0 plus iota into 1. Now, Comparing real and imaginary parts we get 1 into cos theta is equal to 0 and 1 into sin theta is equal to 1. This implies that cos theta is equal to 0 and this implies that sin theta is equal to 1. Now, we need to obtain the value of theta for which cos theta is equal to 0 and sin theta is equal to 1, right? Now, we know that cos pi by 2 is equal to 0 and sin pi by 2 is equal to 1. So, this implies that theta is equal to pi by 2. Hence, z in the polar form is given by r that is 1 into cos pi by 2 plus iota sin pi by 2. So, this is the required polar form of iota. So, hope now you would be able to convert the complex numbers into their polar forms. So, take care and bye.